With the climate realities we are facing, it is no longer enough to build green, to build safe, and build affordably. Resiliency has become a critical aspect of construction and especially of our most valuable commodities, our homes. And in order to provide resiliency, we must build in adaptability, allowing our homes to adapt to anything that nature can throw at them. We have seen that buildings must be stronger, must be monolithic and aerodynamic to withstand the forces of tornadoes and high winds, but buildings must also be designed to adapt to rising waters and flooding in some areas. Our solution is to build foundations that float, foundations that elevate the home to survive the 90-year floods, and then separate from the earth to float above the water in case of catastrophic events. We can do this using existing materials and technologies combined with smarter building methods, and in so doing, provide affordable, resilient housing that not only is capable of surviving even the worst flooding, but that enables us to develop marshlands and other wetland areas with zero net impact on the environment. The foundations can work essentially like a ship's hull, as shown previously, or can inflate, as shown here, to elevate the home above rising water levels. These examples illustrate different ways we can design safety and resiliency into our homes, allowing us to adapt to the increasingly challenging environmental realities we will be facing. Ideas like these also illustrate how we can expand housing into marshlands and wetlands in safe and ecological ways.